Mike McGee. Save McMath, second ball, McGee in a miraculous recovery from Zach McMath to keep it out. Patrick, first take us back to the game against Philadelphia, obviously a disappointing way not to get three points, but still show another fight back to, to get a draw. Um, yeah, we, we're not satisfied with just fighting back and trying to get the draw. You know, we I think we're a better team and uh, we're a better team than, you know, the record shows and, you know, we need to some somewhat, you know, complete the points, getting the points as opposed to come, have to having to come back and snatch them one, you know, we've we've dropped a couple points that we for sure thought or knew we should have. So it's it's a little difficult and disappointing on that aspect. But um, you know, there's a lot of positives you can pick up from that game and uh, you know, hopefully whatever way it takes, you know, we, we, we come up with some wins instead of draws. Greg, uh, your uh, trade right at the beginning of the season didn't get into the first few games, but you've seized the opportunity of uh, Gonzalo Cigar's injury and I think improved every game. How, talk about your performance thus far. Yeah, I mean, obviously every time you get the chance, you got to be ready. Um, even when I wasn't playing, uh, you always got to prepare like you are ready. So when the chance does come, you know, you got you to take it and, and you got to run with it. So um, I just try to improve every day, uh, get better each game and stuff like that. So. You know, with more time with the team, I finally, you know, I feel real comfortable with the team finally now. Montreal is a team that's had similar issues in defense, but uh, a very potent attack. Guys like DeVaio, Justin Matt, Felipe, and they've just added Jack McInerney. Talk about how difficult that challenge will be on Saturday. Yeah, it's going to, obviously, it's going to be a real good challenge. Um, we have to stay concentrated for, you know, the full 90 minutes when you have guys like uh, DeVaio and McInerney, they like to sit off your back shoulder and try to get them behind. So we're going to have to know where they are at all times. And then, you know, guys like Felipe and Matt, they're very good out wide and they're good 1v1 players. So um, if we can limit their chances, then I think we're, we're going to give ourselves a good shot to win the game. Finally, talk about facing Frank Klopas. He's someone that you were started your rookie here, rookie year here uh, as technical director and was your coach. Uh, obviously, a bond there, but you're on opposite sides on Saturday. Um, it's going to be an interesting game, you know, both of us, I think, are searched for our first wins in the year and, uh, you know, I think we have been um, unfortunate not to have gotten our first um, win of the year because we, we've played some great soccer, we've improved, you know, every single game, you know, playing wise and stuff, you know, there's a little uh, mistakes we need to correct to ensure um, getting maximum points in the games and uh, it's going to be an interesting game, we're looking forward to it, you know, I think we are better prepared going into the game, you know, um, correcting the mistakes we we did last game to not have gotten us the three point. And so we're looking forward to it and I think we, we are prepared to go to go get a win up there.